So I was running back to the base to quickly heal up to, um, before finding our next client. And I wandered straight into him. I didn't even talk to him. I just had him call out to me. It's like, hey you, yeah, there's a problem? Yeah, you're the new kids from like Nutsy Guild, aren't you? Not exactly. Shut up. <laughs> What's his problem? Kids, kids like you don't belong in guilds. Kids like you don't understand the real world. It's no fun in games. Kids like you are easy praise. Uh, apparently this guy cannot speak properly. I've got a feeling his backstory is, is he had a kid who joined a guild and got himself killed. For a second there, I thought he was going to be, like, threatening us to leave the guild or something. Okay. Are you peeping in that house? weird. I'm sure there's more people to here than there was before. I certainly don't remember half these people. I'm not recognising any of these, like, things. Ooh. Thought you'd be the client. Very mage looking. Fair enough. I need to go there anyway at night. Well, while I'm here, is there anything else I can do? Quests. So, seen the client. That's in another town. That's go to the plains at night. I thought it was five quests, not four, but maybe I get one later. Maybe one of them's an affinity quest. I went and checked. Everyone's affinity's gone up by five. Well, everyone who's been in my party whilst I've been fighting. Ah. Uh, and simple life. we go come on come on i do like the new city design it's a little awkward to walk around but it certainly looks more alive i really appreciate the effort that's been put in so that's planes to the west all right i kind of skipped that i kind of thought he is he doing something or is he loading barrels i guess he's just loading barrels oh it's that guy again Dog Squad Fighter? Okay. This this definitely smells of side quest here. Actually, what am I doing? What am I doing? This is... I don't have to do any of this. I just need to go... Come on. Control Boris. Greetings, Boris. I hope you don't mind if I uh, kick your ass. Alright, so he's weak to water. Um, yeah, it's just water. And he's, he's a physical attacking sod. So, skill. Nah, no sense for wasting the RP. I'm just going to attack. Everyone gets stuck in. Not too happy about the misses, but <laughs> just boom, blow him away with Dark, Ma uh, Dark Magician Girl. Stronger than you, buddies. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's like the town guards all over the place. Shout for the guards.
Oh, I like Nina's little face there. Watchdog squad. You piss them enough. You piss them off. You've missed the off in that sentence there, mate. All right. That's called mugging, and there's these people called guards around the town, which you could, you know, inform them that these guys are robbing you in the street. How do they evade capture? They're in one town. The town's not that big. <laughs> They've probably got descriptions of these guys. All oh, right, so this explains why we're pretty much um, the only ones going guild jobs is because you've got these idiots going around beating up newbie guilds. Excellent, new squad. New squad? New, new quest! Beat up the squad! Oh, uh, Doc Q, if you're watching this, which I'm guessing you are at this point, if, you, if you're familiar with the uh, Baldur's Gate 2 game from uh, PlayStation, not the PC, the, the PC games for the Baldur's Gate series are amazing, but the scrolling beat em up ones for uh, Baldur's Gate 2 on the PlayStation 2, look up the innkeeper of Soundbite because you have to quote that somewhere. Random looking knight here. I'll be honest, if I'm making a party, I'd rather have two fighters. I mean, on average, you want like two DPS. Or two tanks. Oh yes, the, the planes are to the uh, west. They're quite remote, to be honest. Ooh. Enemy ambush. Swift Blade Runner. Are you essentially muggers? Alright, so speed and... Oh, yeah, they're basically focused on critical hits. They, could, they can't take magical blasts for anything. Fire kills them. Poison kills them as well. Actually, considering they're so bad about against magic, nope. Um, that should just trash them. Hmm. Oh, I do have to find... Uh, if I don't... Hmm. That's a shame. I need to get kite to have more elemental attacks. Okay, that's... Yeah, I can spend 10 RP. Ow! Wait, they resist that? I thought they were weak to magic. Did I not read that properly? Okay, okay. Oh yes, wind is the one magic they resist. Uh, serves me right for skim reading. Bit OTT, but... Oh, certainly over the kill there. Took far too much damage there, really. Rusty coin, hazy orbs. I'm going to presume. Oh, oh, what's happened there with the head? <laughs> That's quite funny. Okay. Okay. We're gonna try find as a quest giver. 
normally, like I would do with my other videos, I would kind of skim this and, you know, uh, just skip it until I found the quest giver. But it's been so long since I played the game. I'm just going to go around and explore the town again and just have a quick chat with everyone. Do you actually like her sprite? And the minimap's so much better. Who's this guy again? Oh? What's that? Those armbands. What armbands? Uh. Oh, this is the, um... Yeah, that's the Marauder cleanup. Oh, and they're in all the different towns. So I can go around and ask about them. Fair enough. So it sounds like their company's just going under because they're not keeping up with uh, modern methods. Oh, this is going to be the kidnapping quest line again. So this is the mental health hospital. Okay, no one's really mentioned anything about the, uh... Ooh. Nah, not really. No one's really mentioned anything about, like, guilds. Young fighters, former competitors of the Colosseum. So someone's kidnapping, um, young girls. Guy, big huge guy. Oh, that's Bane. No, to be fair, it could also be, um... Oh, who's the villain from, uh... Saints Row 3? Like, Kilgore or something like that. I can't... I've, it's been so long since I've played it. But yeah, I, I, I'm definitely seeing, um... The, well, the inn's locked. Um, yeah, I'm definitely seeing a few, uh... signs I recognize from the kidnapping quests in the past. Yeah, so I think I've already done this quest. It's just been like in reintroduced into the game. Okay. I if there's anything hidden behind the house. Little disappointed there's no secret there. Just a random item would have been good, nice. And I'm gonna save just in case this one railroads me into doing something. Actually, I should save anyway. Actually, I'm gonna... Before I carry on with the quest, I'm just going to um, check the house out. It certainly is. Yeah, I can't talk when I'm standing opposite him. And now I go there. Some dragon. Quick. 
quite likely because you've been using the same trade routes for like all eternity. Uh, transportations. update his wife's okay Okay, well, I, that kind of came out the blue, to be honest. It, that whole information about his wife is kind of like, eh, was I not? So I was I supposed to talk to someone else about that? So his wife's left because he won't update his transport method or his business methods or something. Okay. I mean, carriages and horses are actually pretty decent, but you just need to upgrade your quality of carriage and horse. You know, like having your uh, soldiers be trained in particular ways of guarding them and stuff like that. That's not really any good information. Okay, now that is extreme. If your guards are specialised in particular weapons, I mean, spear, pole arms are brilliant for set, being sat on top of a carriage. A shotgun is brilliant for being sat on the side of the carriage. Oh yeah, he's just dumb. So dumb, he's just cannot adapt. So he's about to go out of business, basically. That description isn't great. I am... Well, if they know where you're leaving from, they can pretty much... Um... You know... If you know where you're leaving from, they can pretty much go, all right, they, they uh, go up to this point and then they split off. They can be followed, they can do all sorts of things to basically give them the information. Though it's probably quite likely there's a spy in the house.
No, it's not. <laughs> you fool. I mean, why is he having this guy's walk next to the carriage? No wonder they're going so slow. Well, that's his company in the dirt then. Absolutely flimming ridiculous. It would be quite funny if she is stealing all of her father's supplies and then she's going to start her own company up. Okay. And with that, I think we'll go to our next episode. <laughs>